Sadia, since the start of this divinely orchestrated yet ever convoluted journey has been running from his fears and the wondrous love concealed within but his never ending struggle has an inevitable result of mental and spiritual exhaustion he looks around and finds himself standing alone with his dear far from sight since it began the journey has shifted all things in his world and the karmic things of wood which once bore his name no longer calls to him and his dear structure and love ever known to be unwavering at this point has forsaken his lane and no longer calls him and his dear structure and love ever known to be unwavering at this point has forsaken him and for now he feels she is not for the divine has stepped in to bring more lessons and even some from the abyss for his darkness must be transmitted to the light and now even in his dreams he drowns in his emotions of fear of losing this connection his trust of those around him has been shaken and the defenses of ego are on alert but despite this the dm now views the dia as his equal for the tides have turned for with his deep love for her he knows that she can hurt him all the same as she was once hurt for the polarity of love is and always will be pain